the script HTML tag. Script HTML tag is tag that we use to define various scripts for our HTML document. For example, if we want to use JavaScript function inside of our HTML document, we can use script HTML tag. There are two ways that you can use scripts in our HTML document. First one, you can define JavaScript function directly in the script HTML block. And on second way, you can import some external JavaScript file, so in that way you can use functions from that file in our HTML document. In that case, we need to use type HTML attribute, which defines what is type of script, and SRC, which defines location and the file name of script that you want to import. Okay, next thing, let's create one more empty file. Here we will create one simple JavaScript function. Let's call it welcome. Basically, you can call it anything you like, but I will call this one welcome. And this one will open for us alert pop-up window with text welcome to masterminds tutorials okay so let's save this file let's save this one inside of scripts folder and i will call this one welcome.js and make sure that you're using .js extension for this file okay so now inside of our index web page Let's create one simple HTML button, like a label for this button. Let's set welcome. So what is the idea? When we click on our welcome button, I want to call welcome JavaScript function that we have defined in our welcome JS file. So first thing we need to link welcome with the script HTML element. Inside of start script tag, we need to define type and src HTML attributes. For type attribute, we need to set what is the type of script, that is text slash JavaScript. Okay. And for src attribute, we need to point on file that we want to use. Our file is inside of scripts folder. So let's set that path first. Okay. And now from scripts folder, we can point on any file that we want, that is welcome.js file. So let's set that part. And now we can use any content from that file inside of this page. So we want to use our welcome function. So basically we can copy this part. Make sure that you will copy brackets. So Take all. Okay. Inside of button, let's define on click HTML attributes. So basically, when we click on that button, we want to call. So let's paste our JavaScript function here. Okay. We can save our index web page for now. So basically, what we have done here. Now, when we click on our welcome button from our welcome JS file, welcome to mastermind tutorials alert will be open inside of our web page so here it is this is welcome button let's click on it and we have our alert pop-up with welcome to mastermind tutorials text okay so basically this is the first way how you can use script html tag to import external javascript file and use JavaScript function from that file. Second way how we can use script HTML tag is way that you can directly write JavaScript functions inside of your HTML page. So with start and end script tag, inside of it, we can define any JavaScript function that we want. For example, like we have our function from welcome.js file, we can copy content from here and let's paste it inside of our script log. 
Let's align this a little bit. Okay. So now we can customize our welcome function. Basically, we can just change, let's say, name. Instead of welcome, let's use thanks. And let's customize our alert text. Let's use something like thanks for watching our tutorials. Okay. So now let's create one more button here. We can duplicate this one with Control D. Our second button will have label thanks. And instead of welcome that we are using, we'll use thanks JavaScript function from our script block. So let's paste it here. Okay. And let's save our changes. So now in our web page, we'll have two buttons. So let's refresh it. We have thanks button. Let's click on it. And here it is. We have new alert with the text that we have set inside of our alert function. Okay. So basically our thanks function from script block will be called when we call our thanks button. So first way we can use script just to call some external JavaScript functions from external file. And the second way you can use script block to define JavaScript functions directly inside of your HTML document. Thanks for watching this tutorial and I hope this was helpful to you. If you like our work, please become a Patreon or simply donate our PayPal. Please remember, even a little from you means a lot for us. You can follow us on our Twitter and Instagram profiles. And please don't forget to subscribe on our YouTube channel. Because on our YouTube channel, knowledge is waiting for you.